The Diana is a new 155mm self-propelled howitzer. It was jointly developed by Constructed Defense of Slovakia and Bumer Lebdy of Poland to meet an Indian Army requirement. A prototype of the Diana was first publicly revealed in 2015. It is also being proposed for other possible customers. The Slovak Zuzana 2 uses an 8x8 wheel chassis. However, the Indian Army preferred the tracked chassis. So Constructed Defense of Slovakia teamed up with a Polish company to create a new artillery system. The Diana consists of Slovakian Zuzana 2 turret, mounted on a Polish UPG and G tracked chassis. The chassis uses many components of the T-72 main battle tank. It was one of the main reasons why a Polish Dane was selected. It is worth nothing that Indian Army operates many license-produced T-72 MBTs, so common components would simplify servicing and logistics. In concept Diana is essentially similar to the older Himalaya that was also aimed at a possible Indian Army requirement. The Himalaya was a combination of Zuzana turret mated with a tracked chassis of T-72 tank. However it received no production orders. The Diana has a complete turret of the Zuzana 2. It is armed with a 155mm L55 gun. It is compatible with all standard NATO ammunition. The gun is mounted externally between two separated compartments of the turret. In this way the crew is completely isolated from potentially dangerous gun and autoloader mechanisms and is protected from the powder gases generated during firing. Turret traverse is 360, however firing envelope is limited to 60. This self-propelled howitzer is capable of direct and indirect fire. The Diana has an automatic ammunition loading system. It loads shells and charges at any elevation. Shells and charges are stored in conveyors and are fed automatically. Beds and conveyors are universal for all 155mm projectiles and charges. There is a fuse setter for automatic setting of electronic fuses. The Diana would normally carry three main types of ammunition, including standard high-explosive rounds, extended-range high-explosive rounds and high-explosive anti-tank rounds for direct firing at an armored targets. Range of fire depends on projectile and charge combination. Maximum range of fire is more than 41 kilometers with rocket-assisted projectile. This artillery system can automatically launch 5 rounds within the first minute or 13 rounds within 3 minutes. Manual loading is possible, however rate of fire is reduced to 2 rounds per minute. Sustained rate of fire is around 1.5 rounds per minute. The Diana is capable of multiple round simultaneous impact firing MRSI. It can launch a couple of rounds at different trajectories in order for them to hit the target simultaneously. This artillery system carries an impressive ammunition load of 80 rounds, out of which 40 rounds and associated charges are stored in autoloader conveyors. Remaining 40 rounds are stored inside the hull. This self-propelled howitzer has an automatic gun laying mode. Firing data is calculated by the onboard computer and the gun is laid on the target automatically. Vehicle is fitted with a navigation system. Onboard fire control system allows to operate with digital maps. There is a secondary roof-mounted 12.7mm machine gun for self-defense. The Diana has quick preparation for firing and brief redeployment time. It can fire a couple of rounds and leave the firing position before the enemy opens counter-battery fire. This self-propelled howitzer is operated by a crew of four, including commander, gunner, loader and driver. The Diana has a high level of automation. Armor of the Diana provides protection against small arms fire and artillery shell splinters. Front arc withstands hits from 14.5mm armor-piercing rounds. Vehicle is fitted with NBC protection and automatic fire extinguishing systems. The Polish UPGNG tracked chassis uses many components of the PT-91 main battle tank that in turn is an improved Polish variant of the Soviet T-72. This chassis was originally developed for the Polish Crab self-propelled howitzer. However later Poland selected a South Korean K-9 chassis for the Crab and the UPGNG chassis was dropped. Chassis of the Diana has some improvements comparing with its older version of the UPGNG. Vehicle is powered by an S12U diesel engine, developing 850 horsepower. It is a modified version of the T72 power pack. 
engine is mated to a manual transmission. Normally a battery of Dianas would be supported by a fire control vehicle and ammunition resupply vehicles. However, if required, each Diana howitzer can operate on its own. 